As Formula One races into Austin, a local congressman is asking the federal government to lend some help. KXAN's Chris Sadegi live at Austin Berkshire International Airport with more on where those resources could go, if anywhere at all. Chris? Well, Robert, the local agencies say they have a plan and they are ready, but Congressman Mike McCall says they have not received enough help from Washington. And with an international event like this, a lot of people flying in, it's help they certainly could use. Everybody ready? For months, they've said they will be ready, and Monday they said the same, but all that confidence comes with a very important disclaimer. We're used to that here in Austin, but we've never seen anything like this. I think a lot of people don't realize uh, how big this event is going to be. Congressman Michael McCall thinks it's big enough to get the nation's capital involved. The Super Bowls are designated as a national event, and I think this is clearly a, a national event. McCall is the chair of oversight on the Homeland Security Committee and says with so many international visitors inside a stadium this big, Washington should be involved. So far, they haven't, and he wants that to change. It's going to take some persuasion. Uh, I, I don't think they've delivered in, in the resources uh, already. At the same time, everyone else in the room says they're ready to handle it anyway, but aren't going to turn away extra help. Chief Art Acevedo says they're still looking for volunteers who can speak more than one language. So we're probably going to have some uh, Middle Eastern folks here where we don't have as many volunteers. We have the translation services available. Whether Washington shows or not, a plan is in place. But the mayor admits not everything goes according to plan. As the world are going to be on us, uh, uh, at the same time, we know it's going to be a bit of a learning experience. We're going to learn something from this first event. And TSA and the airport were a part of that meeting, and they say they'll have four extra lanes open that weekend to help with the customs. And as a bonus, they'll leave those lanes open all the way through Thanksgiving. We're live at Bergstrom Airport. Chris Sadegi, KXAN News.